Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're taking a closer look at the latest Reminder app update. And the best part is, you don't need to install the One UI 8.5 beta to get these new features. As always, the download link is in the description down below, so make sure to check that out after the video. And if you enjoy these quick updates, breakdowns, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps the channel grow. All right, let's dive in and talk about what's new. So here on screen, I have got the old Reminder app. And here on my phone, I'll go ahead and start up the new Reminder app. So the first thing you'll notice is as soon as you open the Reminder app, it's got this brand new bluish gradient background. So it gives the app a much fresher, modern look compared to the older flat design. However, most of the buttons and UI elements remain mostly unchanged. So it still feels familiar if you've been using the apps regularly. One of the small but noticeable tweak is at the bottom. The Add Reminder button now sits inside a more compact, shorter capsule style bar. So it's a subtle change, but does make the bottom area look much more cleaner and more refined. Now let's talk about creating reminders. When you go ahead and tap on Add Reminder, you'll see that the floating reminder panel has now been redesigned. It now sits separately from the keyboard, which gives everything more breathing room and reduces that cramped feeling the old version had. So this separation also makes it easier to focus on what you're typing without the keyboard covering half the panel. It's not a massive redesign, but it does improve the overall usability. Now the next change is try these out features. It gives you quick tips and presets examples for reminders, but here's a new thing. Inside the three dot menu, there is now an additional option that wasn't there previously. It's not a game changing feature, but it shows Samsung is slowly refining and expanding the app's settings and shortcuts. So you have the try these out feature new. So these little additions might be small, but now they add up over time to create a more polished experience. So overall, this update isn't a huge visual overhaul, nothing too dramatic. It's more of a polished and refined type of update, small UI changes and a cleaner background, a more modern reminder panel and a slightly reorganized menu. But if you like staying up to date with Samsung's app, this is definitely a nice upgrade to have. And again, you don't need the One UI 8.5 beta to install this version. You can simply download it from the link in the description down below and use it right away. And that's it for today's breakdown of the brand new Reminder app update. If you found this video helpful, please make sure to hit the like button, drop a comment, letting me know what you think of the new design. And of course, subscribe for more Samsung app updates and tips. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.